Hello, welcome back to Double Punch Whenever, and we are officially at 1,000 subscribers. Well, actually, we're at 1,005 overnight, so yeah. And this is the 1K appreciation video for you guys. So, I am so excited to hit 1K. I hit 1K last night around the same time that Nerf Talk quit YouTubing. Because life just throws stuff at you that you can't handle and that you don't enjoy anymore. So, yeah. And now he wants me to, to keep going with my channel so I can keep growing like he did. And, yeah. I'm gonna be... Just like Nerf Talk with this channel, but not with retiring though. I'm gonna keep going. So yeah, this is one of the best things that ever happened to me was hitting 1,000 subscribers. It feels so good. And just means I have more epic reviews coming and all that and all that really good stuff. And yeah. It's going to be awesome and just fun, so. And one of the best blasters I got between one between zero subscribers and a thousand is this one. This is one of the best things I ever ordered for the channel. The Nerf Limited Halo Needler. It's just is an awesome blaster and I think it's one of the best ones I ever ordered. For a hundred bucks, I'd say it's worth it. So, yeah. A lot, another f few other good blasters I got was the Nerf Pro Strife X, the Nerf Elite 2.0 Double Punch, the Dodge on Max Outlaw, the Dodge on Cover Ops Thunderbolt, and there's and the X Shot Insanity Mortars Rage Fire, the X Shot Insanity. Mad Maggie Rail, the X-Shot Insanity Berserker, the X-Shot Insanity Manic, those are all good blasters that came out from X-Shot this year. And I absolutely love what the Nerf Hobby and X-Shot Hobby and stuff is all doing for everybody. Making great blasters, making blasters that are bad too, which is obviously, when people review bad blasters, it still makes a good video. So yeah, and I want to give some shout outs real quick to at Mark's Nerf Vlog, at Nerf Talk, I, I want to give a shout out to at Not Enough Nerf for sticking with me through my YouTube journey so far. I want to give a shout out to The Boy Cave, I want to give a shout out to that Kentucky, Rum that Kentucky Rumbler guy, and... Yeah, I would say that this channel is not going to stop. This channel is still growing, and I ain't giving up on it. I'm going to keep the channel going. The coffee I'm drinking is Starbucks Double Shot Energy. It's a pretty good one. Not sponsored by Starbucks, though. And it's pretty good, though. It's the caramel flavor. So yeah. Thank you all for getting me to 1,000 subscribers in a short period of time of five and a quarter months. That's pretty good for just starting YouTube this year. Five, five, almost five and a half months ago, I was not even... Uh, Nerf YouTuber, and June 1st is the day I picked up my phone and said, I'm going to start a YouTube channel, and yeah, that's when I came out, came up with the name, Zombies Nerf Master, and that name got changed when I hit 250 subscribers to Dr. Vision Nerf Vlogs, and then that name got changed when I hit like 750 subscribers to Double Punch Pro Nerfer, and now I'm at 1,000. 
I don't know if I want to do a name change, which I don't think I am, because I don't want to change my name again. That just looks unprofessional. And yeah. So, I want to keep it professional with this channel. So, I got big dreams for this channel. And yeah, this is what I've been wanting is to grow my channel with subscribers and just have fun while doing it. And that's what I'm doing. I'm having fun while doing it. It's amazing. The Nerf hobby is truly fun and has some really awesome blasters that came out this year. And last year had awesome, some awesome ones too. The Moto Blitz. That was a good one from last year. The Double Punch is a good one from this year, from the Elite Point Online. Can't wait, I can't wait to see what Nerf is going to come out with for next year's Elite 2.0 newest blaster. If they even do come out with a new Elite 2.0 blaster for next year. But yeah. So, I also want to give a shout out to Tester's Nerf Room. Because Tester's Nerf Room is helping me going to be helping me with the project for on a Nerf Robux at Diamond Beast. He's going to be modding it for me with a new lever for the lever action that is going to help with comfort. A new cylinder. And yeah. A whole new color scheme too. So I asked him if he could do red and black because that's the color scheme I want. Is a red and black Roblox at Diamond Beast. So yeah. Shout out to you, Tessera's Nerf Room. And I also might have a review today. It depends on if it is out for delivery or not. But I'll have to check the app and see. So, yeah. I'm just shocked I hit 1,000 subscribers in such a short period of time. Can't wait to see. Can't wait for when I hit 2,000 subscribers. That would be insane, but... Not there yet, but I'll get there. Takes time. Oh yeah, and shout out to Daniel Nian. He has some epic reviews. If you haven't checked him out, go check him out. He's amazing. He's got some great reviews. He's a pretty cool guy. He's got some great videos and some great content. Great Nerf reviews and Dark Zone reviews too. I'm the one that got him into actually liking the Dark Zone Max Outlaw. He thought it was going to be not a good one, and it actually, he liked it. So I'm glad I recommended the Dark Zone Max Outlaw to him. So yeah, my next review might be today or tomorrow, but we'll see. I'll check the app, and yeah. I also got more other reviews from Timu coming soon. Tomorrow's, tomorrow, I think, is the 12th. And so it says it's going to be delivered between the, between November 12th and November 19th. So sometime between that period of time. And yeah. Also, I do have some action figure orders on Sunday that I order for my action figure channel. If you haven't checked that one out, it's called Judgment Figures Wrestling. Definitely go check out that one. And... But today... I gotta order the Nerf Ultra Scream Machine for the 1K sub video, and if I order it today, it should be here in about five days. So yeah, like the 16th, something like that, maybe the 15th. So yeah, and you guys are literally amazing. You guys are so amazing for getting me to 1,000 that fast and yeah I am just so happy I hit a thousand in such a short period of time like I said I have done some really good reviews and last night when I was talking to Tessera from Tessera's Nerf Room I was talking about the Nerf Hyper Field 20 and, I, and he said that one has a lot of issues like when I reviewed mine it did not have a lot of issues because I didn't have any issues with the Field 20 no. When I was firing it, I had no issues. When I was loading it, no issues. When I was priming it, no issues. Because I love that prime. Right now, there's no rounds in it, though. But yeah, it's actually a really fun-looking pistol. I love this handguard. 
I love how it's one of the more compact ones. The Rush 40 is a good one, but this one's my favorite. And also has two jam doors. Does the Rush 40 have any? I don't know. I'll have to check. But yeah, this is my favorite Hyper Blaster so far. And I love the color scheme on this one. This one looks super futuristic. With that heart rate monitor kind of vibe going on with it. And the Nerf Hyper on both sides. That's a good thing from Nerf. They got Nerf Hyper on both sides. So yeah. That is my best Nerf Hyper I have so far. I mean the Rush 40 hits a little bit harder than this one. But this one still... I love this one. And yeah. This is my favorite ball shooting pistol. So yeah. So... I just want to do, jump on here to thank you all because you guys are amazing. And stay tuned for more epic reviews. And let's get to 2K subscribers. And Double Punch One Nerfer out. Peace.